welcome back to my channel so last time I finished doing Chloe Ting's four-week summer shred challenge and I found out that she came out with another workout program and this one is called the 15 days intense core challenge I'm just reading it off my iPad so I get the titles correct um, but the title really interested me because I do feel like I need to work on my core strength more like the last challenge it did tone me down and I saw a difference in my stomach area but I feel like I was lacking I was still lacking a lot of core strength overall so ever since I finished the last workout program challenge I wasn't going to pick up another workout program so soon but for the last week, a little more than a week, I haven't really been working out and I've been eating a little bit more. So I decided to get myself back on track by doing this workout program. And this time I'm a little more prepared. So I'm going to try and record every single day that I do her workout videos so that I can hold myself a little more accountable and not skip days as well as for this YouTube video. Okay, now let me show you a clip of how my body, my stomach looks right now and then we'll jump right into the workout. This is how my stomach looks when I'm in a relaxed position. As you can see, compared to my aftershot from the last challenge, it's not as flat as before, especially the lower belly area. And this is how it looks when I flex my stomach. You can't really tell from the front, but when you look at it from the sides, you can kind of see. So that's how my stomach looks right now. Um, I don't think it looks that bad, especially after doing the four week summer stretch challenge. I think it toned down a lot, but I do want to focus more on my inner core strength and uh, strengthening that. <laughs> so that's my main goal and that's what I hope to improve on by the end of this workout program, hopefully. <laughs> Um, today's video for day one, it's the best full body burn as well as the tight core plank challenge and it's only 24 minutes so that's not bad. Um, there's also three other optional videos but I think I'm gonna skip that. <laughs> This move was pretty hard. I think I'm doing like a quarter push up <laughs> instead um, now that I'm looking at it. And this one really challenged my stability and core strength. So I had to do the low impact one, the bird dog instead. And I was still kind of wobbly. I was so happy that I finally finished the first video of the day, but I did not know what was in store next. I definitely had to stop multiple times throughout this video to take a breather. I took advantage of a lot of the low impact versions. Wow, can I just say that this last move is a killer. Seriously, so glad that I actually made it to the end of this plank video. Every time I do a Chloe Ting workout, by the end of it, like I'm always drenched in sweat. Hey, today is day two of, or two, of the 15 day intense core challenge. And today we have three videos. So it's the same two videos from yesterday. And then the third video is the legs and glutes. So that will be interesting. Um, and it's only 37 minutes, so that's not too bad, 
but um, I already know that I'm gonna have a hard time with the plank challenge video yeah <laughs> but anyways um, let's get right into it day two was still very difficult for me I had to take advantage of a lot of the lower impact or easier moves in order for me to get through the whole video hey so for some reason my camera stopped recording during my workout um, but I just finished the the plank challenge video um, and now I'm gonna start the legs and glute. I tried to do as many of those as I could, but towards the end, I had to change back to the bird dog. I look kind of crazy right now, but it's just, I'm sweating, I'm oily, and it's really hot right now. So today's only day three, <laughs> but, um, I feel like this workout program is a lot more intense than the last workout program, um, the Summer Shred. I felt like that one was tolerable, like I could do most, but this one, I think mainly because of the plank workout video, it's just really pushing my limits. Like my arm strength is just not there, it's not. like. I'm trying, like I'm trying to do more push-ups and stuff, but <laughs> it's it's still very weak, so <laughs> but yeah, I we'll see, we'll see. <laughs> so tomorrow is going to be day four and day five there's a rest day, so I am very looking I'm really looking forward to that. Really looking forward. <laughs> I have come to enjoy the full body and abs video. I think it's because I tend to prefer ab workouts in general and this video had that. So I just finished day 
13 really really close to the end now but today oh my god it was so long there was like four videos i'm so tired right now so today is day 14 of the 15 day workout challenge so second to last day um for today there's the abs and full body uh, video and then there's also love handle workout video that one's new um, I don't think I don't think I've done that one before yeah it's the only one so I'm looking forward to the exercises in that one and it's only 35 minutes today so not that bad um, and then I also see that the like challenge video is optional so <laughs> You know what that means. I mean, I should probably do it, but for today, I think I'm good. <laughs> everyone right now it is 6 30 p.m and do you know what day it is it is day 15 of the 15 day intense core challenge yes. today is the last day um so it's kind of a little bit late right now so we'll jump right into the exercises we have three exercise videos for today um there's actually two full body exercise videos and then of course the plank challenge video so let's get right into it Today is the day after the last day, day 15, of Chloe Ting's Intense Core Challenge. So this is how my body looks like right now. As you can see, it's gotten a lot flatter compared to when I first started this workout program. And I feel like I've basically gotten back the same body I had when I finished the Summer Shred Challenge. So I'm really happy about that. Oh, and by the way, I didn't change anything. In my diet, I still ate whatever, but just keep in mind to control your portions. Overall, I feel like this workout program was was more intense, was harder than the last workout program I did, the Summer Shred Challenge. Yeah, I feel like this one really tested my upper body strength especially I, i've mentioned this a couple times already but like especially the plank video it really challenged my arm strength which i don't have <laughs> so that's why i had the most difficulty with that plank video like i would try really hard to keep up with all the moves but a lot of times i would just <laughs> i would just do the low impact version the easier version and yeah i feel like even after 15 days i still do struggle with that video i really do think i need to maybe pick up a arm workout program next <laughs> to improve my strength in my upper arms feel like I'm like saying the same thing over and over again <laughs> but it's it's true I think I really do need to focus on an exercise program that will benefit my arms more because I've really just been focusing a lot on like my abs my core and not so much on my arms and also my legs. But this program was really good in helping me get back into shape and getting back into that working out um, attitude because after taking like a week break from working out and eating a little more, <laughs> I felt like I was slowly slipping back into my old 
lazy quarantine self <laughs> so this workout definitely helped me to pick up that motivation again and I feel like I work very well with workout programs because it's like all set out for me and I know what I need to do each day compared to just working out randomly by myself like just random days and random workout videos that I choose I feel like that gives me more of a leeway to kind of not do it I feel like workout programs hold me accountable so I think that's the way to go for me even though this workout program was really challenging I did still really enjoy it so thank you so much to Chloe Ting for making this workout program you are the best and also just want to say to whoever watched up until the end of this video up until now thank you so much for staying and watching until the end I really appreciate it and hopefully I'll get to see you in my next video thank you Bye.